What's going on? You're watching No Rib Law. And here's another new can video. Um, went out, found some money laying around. Uh, got about two bucks. Uh, and I was trying to get you 50, but could not find 50 cents. So I'm on the way and um, I stopped this dude and I uh, asked him 50 cents. And he said he didn't have any 50 cents, he didn't have no uh, change. And he gave me a dollar, so um, I was able to get a can. But when I got there, <laughs> um, I asked if they had any, if he had, they had anything else but Longhorn that was cheap. And he handed me some fucking grizzly snuff, and I already told you guys I don't like snuff, so. Like, nah, just give me a long cot wintergreen longhorn. Um, got it for a nice low price of 149 Not bad. I could have got two cans, but I promised my little brother I'd get him a soda, so. Went and, uh, some can. Um, I mean, I still have a little bit of this left. See how much I have. I haven't chewed this since like this morning. The only thing though know, with, with Longhorn is it's kind of dry. I don't necessarily like that. Because it like, it brings up the, uh, um, what do you call it? Uh, the mucusy, like, sticky shit when you spit and you have that long little stream that, like, will not fucking, like, leave. Um, but, yep, let's uh, crack open in this can and let's see what Longhorn, Long Cut, Wintergreen is gonna be like. It's cute, baby. down this real quick get rid of this so I can use it to spit in but Pepsi next is not that good it's just like the Pepsi throwback or the diet Pepsi it just has 60 cal I don't fucking know Nice and strong. That's got like a good uh, Copenhagen like stench that it had, like. If only this was fucking like that three, four D shit where you would actually smell it. it smells hella good on here. Smell it. Oh. Ooh, that's gonna burn like a bitch. But whatever. I ain't a bitch. I'm a dude. But a shout out to my um, my homie Southern Dippin. I don't know. Let me see what their whole name is. I don't know what it is, but uh, uh my word, fuck is it? Yeah, Southern Dippin Five Ten. When they uh did that three can video with uh Copenhagen Natural, that kid had some fucking balls. Like, I would have fucking thrown up after, the, like, fucking half a can of it. Like, I put a big, nice, fatty pinch in one time of Coke Natural. And that shit was fucking horrible. Like, I fucking, I put too much in. I was trying to pack it down right here. And, it, um, it was, it was fine. And I, I dipped while I take a shower. So, like, I'm sitting there, I'm like, you know, spitting in the fucking stream. And, um, you know, I'm just like, oh, shit. Took out my dip and I put it um, on top of my uh, body wash, a little body wash, and um, I'm just like I'm sitting there, sort of burping, you know, uh, you know, I kept doing that, and then next, you know, I start fucking throwing up like fucking uh, fruit punch, fucking Kool Aid, and fucking the fucking uh, little pizza pockets, not the like the, the little tiny ones. Start throwing that shit up, and I was like, fuck. 
So I give props to Southern Dip and 510. So you guys are fucking legit. Um, definitely go give them a look. They're a good, pretty good channel. Also, uh, go check out Fire Dip Medic and then Nathan B Man. Nathan B Man is good for reviews. Um, but a lot of the stuff down here, a lot of the stuff up there where he's at is not down here. I have to go to fucking Hicktown, like fucking Lincoln and Wheatland and some shit to fucking get Stoker's Peach, whatever. But, um, definitely give those guys a fucking subscribe and subscri friend them, whatever. Let's stop wasting time put a dip in. Get back this can't be. And the thing with this is I can never get a fucking pinch. So I always gotta fucking pack it twice. Yeah. But I spent all fucking day, a whole fucking day, applying for jobs, and then like I fill out all the surveys and shit, and then they would tell me my fucking my resume wasn't eligible. I wasn't eligible to work for them. So I'm just like, I filled out a good 200 applications today, and that shit was fucking. It's fucking ridiculous. First assumption is it's pretty damn good. Usually with um Copenhagen wintergreen burns hella bad like right here. And like I like it, but it kinda gets old after a while. Um you know, grizzly, about the same thing. But when you get it right here, and this big fatty one, it's just right here. Which shouldn't be right there, it should be like right here. It um it leaves just like it like cuts into your gums and shit. But um with this one, it doesn't burn too bad, it's not it's not super horrible. I mean, pretty good dip. So if you got longhorn wintergreen natural um so far, all the brands that um I've tried. Oh, the fine cut natural, long cut straight, the long cut wintergreen. The last one that I'm going to try with that is uh, their long cut mid. So, and then I'll be done with these guys, stop buying the cans and start going back to my Copenhagen, start collecting tin lids again, but it is what it is man. But Thanks for watching this video, like it, subscribe to me, do what you gotta do, and get me out there. Alright, peace out homie.